When rice is picked from the field, it has a brown appearance. This is because the rice kernel is naturally covered by a bran layer. This brown rice can be eaten as is, or the rice kernel can be sent to the mill where the bran layer is removed, turning the brown rice into white rice. This processing helps prevent spoilage and makes the rice a bit easier to chew, but it also strips the rice of important vitamins and nutrients. One of the vitamins that gets stripped away is thiamine, also known as B1, which is a B-complex vitamin needed for proper nerve function and glucose metabolism. In this lesson, we will learn more about thiamine and what happens to your body if you get too little or too much of this important vitamin. Thiamine deficiency is when you get too little B1. This can result in a disorder called beriberi, which is a condition characterized by weakness and neurological symptoms. Heart changes may also be seen depending on the type of beriberi present. Beriberi means I cannot, which refers to the extreme weakness that comes with this condition. To help you recall this term, you might want to think of beriberi as a disorder that makes you so weak you can barely, barely walk. This weakness comes about because a thiamine deficiency makes it hard to break down glucose for energy. Since glucose is the primary energy source for your nerve cells and your brain, you end up feeling worn out, both physically and mentally. Additional neurological symptoms, ranging from tingling sensations in the hands and feet to paralysis, may be due to the fact that thiamine is needed to make neurotransmitters, which are chemical substances that relay a message from a nerve cell to another cell. In beriberi, the lack of thiamine means the message does not go through. People living in the United States do not typically suffer from beriberi, even if they consume a lot of refined grains. This is because grains eaten in developed countries, like the U.S., tend to be enriched, which means vitamins such as thiamine are added back after the grain is processed. Food sources for thiamine, in addition to enriched grains, include pork, seeds, and legumes, which are things like beans, lentils, and peas. Yet thiamine deficiency is still seen in populations of the world that consume processed grains that are not enriched and where other thiamine-rich foods are unavailable. We also want to remember that thiamine, like other B-complex vitamins, is a water-soluble vitamin, which means that it dissolves in the watery environment of the body and is easily flushed out of the body. Because of this, thiamine needs to be replenished regularly for good health. So if you think about it, anything you do that makes you have to go to the bathroom more often would deplete water-soluble vitamins more rapidly. This includes abusing alcohol, since alcohol is a diuretic that causes increased urination. Because of this, we do see a condition that is similar to beriberi in alcoholics called Wernicke-Korsakoff syndrome. This is a thiamine deficiency seen in alcoholics characterized by learning and memory deficits and mental confusion. To make matters worse, alcohol abuse decreases thiamine absorption in the digestive tract, so any of the thiamine that is consumed in a diet of an alcoholic might not make it into their body. Learning what happens to the body when thiamine is deficient makes it easy to see why many foods are enriched with this vitamin. Yet you might be wondering what happens if you eat too many foods that are high in thiamine and end up consuming more than you need. Well, you don't have to worry about thiamine toxicity because there's no toxic level of thiamine. It seems that any extra is easily passed out of your system without causing harm. Let's review. Thiamine, also known as B1, is a B-complex vitamin needed for proper nerve function and glucose metabolism. It's a water-soluble vitamin, which means that it is easily flushed out of the body and must be replenished regularly to avoid deficient levels. Thiamine is found in enriched grains, pork, seeds, and legumes. If a thiamine deficiency occurs, it may result in beriberi, which is a condition characterized by weakness and neurological symptoms. The neurological symptoms may include tingling sensations in the hands and feet and paralysis. Heart changes may also be seen in certain patients with beriberi. Wernicke-Korsakoff syndrome is a thiamine deficiency seen in alcoholics characterized by learning and memory deficits and mental confusion. 
As for thiamine toxicity, there's no toxic level that causes concern.